Hi everyone, welcome to Jenka Toys and Crafts. Today I'm going to be looking at this Make Your Own Glow Pops kit. It's by Horizon Group USA and it includes five glow sticks. Looks pretty cool and so I'm going to see how this works. Okay, so I opened it up and this is what it came with. It has two packages of the lollipop mix. One's yellow and one is red and they're actually gummy it says so I don't think they're going to be hard lollipops. We'll see. I kind of thought they're going to be like hard suckers but I think they're going to be more like gummy candy and then it came with 10 of these lollipop sticks and two of these plastic holders and these are used to hold the glow sticks to make them glow and here's the tray for the molds and there's six different shapes on there and then also the glow sticks are in here. So um, what you need to do to get started is have some warm water. So I have some warm water here and then I have my mixing container. I'm just gonna get it right here. And the way you do it is you do two scoops of the mix to two scoops of the water. So I think for my first one, and it says you can mix them and make different colors or just multicolored ones. So um, I got this spoon here because I think it would be easier to be scooping out the powder and also the water. So I'm going to start with this cherry mix. So you can see what that looks like. It's just kind of a sticky gummy mixture here. And then I think I will do this heart mold. Like that so you can see it. And I use this cup here because I think it'd be easier to pour, but it's actually kind of thick. So I'm just going to scoop it and stick it in this mold here. Okay, so at this point you can decide if you're going to make a regular lollipop or if you want to try one of the glow ones. So I, of course, want to try one of the glow ones because I think that's going to be really cool. So I'm stick that in there. So if you wanted to just do a regular, you would just stick this right in there. If you want to do one of the glow ones, this is the special glow holder. And so you just stick that in here. And it kind of pops in. Okay guys, so bad news here. This is what it turned out. And it actually turned out really well. The gummy pop is, is really smooth and it's nice and firm. But when I was putting on this glow pop stick, um, I couldn't figure out why I couldn't get it up there high enough and to be in there because you can see on the the box here on the picture it has the little circle like right up there and I just couldn't understand because it just kind of popped right in there in the mold I'll show you that again and I was not understanding that but anyway they realized that what I did was there are two different sides to the mold so you know you can't choose the heart wound to do the glow stick on this side has actual spacing for the glow stick part. So you would pop that in there and then the sucker would have been able to over um, fill that part and stayed on. So unfortunately I didn't do that quite right but the way that you would use it for the glow is it has this end here and it just has like these regular glow sticks, you know, that you buy and um, get one of these out of here, like these, that you just pop and then they start glowing and you would just do that. And I'm not going to do it right now just because this one was not, didn't work out well. And you would just stick that in there and it would glow and that would be really cool. So the top just fell off of that. So now I can show you a little better that if I had done it on the right side, that this would have been here and the top would have been right inside of the lollipop. So that's unfortunate, but um, the candy part turned out really well and um, I think it's really cool. So I probably, um, I'm not going to do a video on the glow part unless you guys really want me to. If I get enough comments below that you actually want me to do another one of these and show you the glow stick part in there, then I will do that. But Otherwise, um, it turned out pretty well, and um, just make sure that you use the right side of the mold. So that's it for today. Thanks so much for watching. Hope to see you next time.